Hey y'all, what's up? So today is Friday and it's Shantae's birthday! Oh Woo! my finger stuck on the glue! So yeah, oh. we're kinda late for our dinner to, where is it again? Cactus Club. Um, it's like 8.30 right now and our <laughs> reservations for 9 o'clock. <laughs> These girls over here oh. are struggling to put on lashes for Shantae, but she has to look like a... <laughs> She doesn't look like a beauty queen. And I love her hair. It's so pretty. Okay. Yeah. And we have Tavon Elwood. Tavon Elwood can give out her full government. Kamisha Parkin. You're lucky you try it over here. Shanice Peterkin. It's on my lip, no? Right? <laughs> that one's a little bit too high on the side. That's okay. So you know pretty. No. Yeah, yeah. Okay, just not pinch, oh. pinch, just pinch. It was high. Was pinch. High. What? She needs five, to do it in the mirror. Look at, yeah. Go in the I mirror know. and do it. No, go look and go fix look it. Look and oh. fix and it. put mascara on after. So I blend. I'm trying to charge you prices, eh? <laughs> five dollars. I looked around. I couldn't see you. <laughs> All right, y'all. We are back at the Cactus Club. The girl was just here yesterday, pretty much. So I'm here again for Shante's birthday. Um, we're going to the rooftop. Yeah, we're going to the rooftop. It's so packed in here, but luckily we're late. Okay, it's not. It's nine, like 9:20. Our reservation was at eight o'clock, and we changed it to nine o'clock. But now we're going. Now we're here. We made it. Now we're going to the rooftop. <laughs> Really, Shante? Don't kill me. <laughs> She's dying. Look at the vibes, y'all.
Hey y'all, what's up? So today is Monday and I'm literally going through all of my stuff trying to make more space. So I literally have my books from university um, when I took social work. So I have like my case management, like a lot of my books, um, my textbooks, human sexuality, multicultural social work in Canada. And I don't know why I'm keeping these books. I guess at first I thought like I was going to be a social worker and that I wanted to be one. So I'm like, oh, if anything, I can go back um, and reference these things. But I've never looked back at them since I graduated. So I'm about to throw these in the recycling. I would like, obviously, it's way too late to sell them. Um, there's obviously like upgrades and everything now or newer versions. So yeah family therapy politics power and the common good this is one of my favorite classes with one of my favorite teachers he was he was mad dope so that crisis intervention this was a book that i dreaded to read because the writing is so small the chapters were so long i literally skimmed this book every single time and like honestly all of this stuff is all online like i can just literally go online and look for all this like euthanasia mm, i don't know what else suicide crisis intervention in general so all of this stuff is gonna go in the recycle bin this is one of shanice's papers me and shanice literally had like every class together so this is one of shanice's papers one of my papers one of my friends from like my literally like one of my only friends from um college she gave me this book on our last day she gave me like a bunch of things i think she was seventh day adventist so like you know she was trying to like convert us to be seventh day because <laughs> we always used to have like debates on like um you know what i believed in what she believed in and everything so yeah i'm trying to go through all of my stuff this thing oh my gosh i had this i don't even know maybe since like my first year and what all i have in here is photos and paint so i'm gonna throw this away obviously i'm gonna take out all the photos um this is when i did the cn tower edge walk with somebody <laughs> look at that how cool is that i look so beat though but I think now they take better pictures. This was like when I feel like when it first first started happening. But you know, gotta keep it for the memories. Super cool. What is this? Oh my gosh, I made this in I think middle school. Oh my god, there's me. I'm so cute. Oh, you light up my life. Oh my gosh, my sister lights up my life because she encourages me to do things that are right for me. She also helps me out when I'm down and helps me back on my feet when I stop trying. She's always there. My sister always helps me with my homework when I'm having trouble and teaches me a lot of new things which I never knew before. Even though we always argue and fight and sometimes give my mom a hard time. But she made me the person I am today. Without her, I wouldn't be as confident and as faithful as I am now. <laughs> that is so freaking hilarious. That's my sister back in the day. Oh my god, I was like probably like in grade 3. My mama. Oh, my mama's so pretty. Look at my mustache. Gosh. My mom looks like she's 15 years old. I was a soccer star, guys. Like, I was shining on everybody. See? <laughs> this is so funny. Look at, my, look at my hair. This is what my hair was 
relaxed and literally breaking off right before my eyes. More, some more soccer. One of my birthdays. Look at me, it's so funny. Anyways guys, let me finish cleaning this. Um, and I gotta put a bunch of new things that I got inside of here. I'm probably gonna put a lot of my giveaway stuff in this bin because I have so much to give away. I think I'm gonna make my giveaway piles, like probably like three or four piles of stuff. Daddy, y'all, so this bin right here actually has all of my notes from like friends and ex-boyfriends and things like that. So this was actually my first boyfriend like ever. And I told you guys, like I was, let me just read it. What up, it's your boy Shots, aka Shooter, aka the Shotta, aka your babe, just chilling right now. Obviously thinking of you, damn you so fine, you blew my mind, lol I'm bored. Well I bought you a camera, it's I at least, I think so. Hope you like it, well you better, it cost me like two bills. Anyways, hope you like it and have a happy birthday, your man Shots. Oh my god, this is so funny, this was probably in grade, I don't know, maybe grade 9 or something like that. But I told you guys, I was always into cameras. I've always, always, always had a camera no matter what. So, yeah, I was always into, like, editing videos, making videos, pictures. Like, trust me. So that's why, you know, he got me a camera because he knew what it was. But anyways, that's another note. Like, I have other notes in here, too. So freaking funny going through this stuff. Dad, oh man. Okay y'all, so this is my first ever vacation with my family and this is the first time we went to Jamaica. And I'm not exactly sure where this was, either in Spanish Town, I think. I think it's Spanish Town, but that is my dad's mom. There's me looking hella crazy. I look crazy on this whole entire trip. There's my mom looking so freaking beautiful. And then there's my sister. Oh my gosh, I love this picture. I don't even know where my grandma is anymore. I think she's in Miami now, but I have no idea. But their apartment, like they lived, it was, it was bad. They lived, they didn't live that well. Um, it was pretty much like they were living outside. But yeah, I think I was, I was in grade four here, I think. Oh, this is so cute. This picture right here, I'm not sure how old I was, but I was younger. But like when I tell you my hair was much kinkier, this was before I permed it and everything. I feel like when I per after I permed my hair, like it just damaged my follicles or something. But like my hair was a lot more kinky um, before I permed it and relaxed it over and over. But yeah, this was when I, you know, celebrated Christmas and everything, you know, opening my presents. But my hair, I just love my hair. It was so pretty. <laughs> This is also my little sister um, on my dad's side. Another soccer picture. Yo, how freaking hilarious is this? This is high school, probably grade nine. Bonds, Munchie, and me. Oh my God, what were we, what were we wearing? What were we wearing? You know, Bonds looks high, but what what is what am I wearing? What is Munchie wearing? Look at the pink shoe with the green socks. <laughs> and I think I'm doing the same. <laughs> and this is before skinny jeans were popular, okay? Okay, guys, I think this is going to be the last one. But this is definitely one of my favorites. It's so freaking adorable. Like, look at our little faces. We look so 90s, too. And I have a story with that skipping rope. I think it was my sister. I think it was my sister. She whipped me across my face with that skipping rope. And I had a big-ass scar on my face. Well, Mark. But yeah, I love this pic. It's so cute. My mom always used to do these little single braids in our hair and it used to get fuzzy at the top. We probably had this in for like, I don't know, a month or something. Okay, maybe not a month. Maybe like two weeks. But it used to get so fuzzy. But I look, I feel like we look so 90s here. Like, look at my sister's shirt. Look at my dress. And underneath the dress, I have like colorful shorts on. Bruh. Hey guys, sorry for looking a mess, but I am still cleaning up. I just made myself some tea because I need some energy. But I'm still trying to like declutter, get rid of things and everything like that. So I have three, four bins that go under my bed. So I have this one right here. 
which is for new products that I want to try out and products that I'm interested. This is for like skincare um, and makeup. Yeah, skincare is over here and then makeup stuff is over here. Yes, I was sent the um, the Fenty Beauty, what is it, the Fairy Bomb as well as her, I don't even know what it's called, the Beach Please thing, the glow thing. Yeah, I got that. <laughs> And then over here is just like um, random things, mostly like memories type things, like pictures, travel stuff, um, and like important documents like to do with my bank and all of that. And then I have this bag. I was gonna do like a whole giveaway bin, but honestly, I don't think I have space for that <laughs> under my bed. So. This whole thing right here is full of giveaway stuff. This is not even the hair products. This is only makeup. So I think tomorrow I'm going to sort through this and start making like piles of what I want to give away. And yeah, um, you guys know this is going to go to you guys, my loyal um, being niecey peeps. That's, this is all going to go to you guys. So I do have one hair product in here. This is the wash day wonder because I already have another one of these. So I'm like, might as well give one of them away. I'm not gonna use all of it. So yeah, this whole thing is full with products to give away. And this is mess. Like, look at all that. This is all recycle, recycle, garbage. Um, I have this little makeup thing. These are for products that I've like touched maybe once and I haven't really touched again. So I put them in here. And then if I don't end up using them in like, I don't know, say the next couple months, then I'm going to throw them away. And then this bin right here is my hair products. I'm, as you can see, I'm not much of a hoarder. Like to me, this is not a lot of products. Well, if you see the products that I have at Brian's house, it's a lot. But for me to get this down to one bin, I feel like it's pretty good. As you can see, my staples right here, Diva Curl shout out to diva curl for sending these out and shout out for you shout out to you guys for um making them notice me and you know they were able to send some stuff over i got my ogx over here i like their conditioners a lot so i gotta keep their conditioners on de Ooh, on deck um i got a few like straight hair products over here um all of my deep conditioners are right here so and then I have a lot of As I Am products as well. I have what is this Carol's Daughter conditioner and shampoo. I have some of my oils and serums over there. But as you can see, like it's not too bad. These are like my basics right now. And in this bin that's already under my bed, these are just like um, hair things. Like I have what do you call these? Flexi rods, perm rods. Um, I have some wigs and I have like braiding hair, connect along braiding hair. I have so many packs of these, so I just like that I, how I kept it organized so I don't have to keep buying um, hairs thinking that I ran out. So right here, I'm trying to organize this stuff. Before I had my books on top, but I'm like, I reach more for my skincare products than I do books, so let me put books second. So I have my skincare that I'm gonna be using like at the moment these are the ones that I want to use right now so have my little pink cashmere I think um, spray what is this from yeah Bath and Body Works I have my Red Fox tub of butter and I also use it with this um, just couldn't fit it so this is the Palmer's cocoa butter and for my skincare, like on my face right now, I'm gonna be using the Refreshing Eye Cream by Origins, if you would wanna focus. That would really help me out. So yeah, this is the eye cream. I also have their Energy Boosting Gel Moisturizer, and I have the Pixi Glow Tonic um, Toner, which is really, really good, and it says my name on it, so cute. But I really like this stuff. And then um, as my serum. Come on. Yeah, my serum. I'm using this. I don't even know how to say it. Ap Aparoism. Bright as day radiant serum. I actually really like this stuff. They randomly send it to me and it's really good. And 
unfortunately so a lot of it spilled over so I'm like already halfway done and then the mask that I want to be using right now which I am going to definitely alternate between my masks um, it's the Ole Henriksen Instant Transformation Lemon Peel. So, yeah, these are all my go-tos for the moment. And then, like, maybe, like, every week or so, I'll just switch them up. And then right here, I have all the other skincare products that I'm going to be, like, alternating with. So, these are, like, my favorite, um, my favorite, what do you call it, moisturizers for my body. You guys know I really only use shea butter and cocoa butter for my body. So these are my favorites right here. I got this from the Ganyan store close by to me. I got this one from my girl Gina B. I got this one from Anu Premium, which you guys seen in a lot of my skincare videos. I still F with that. Um, Over here I have like a cleansing stick by Origin. I have some mm, cleansers by Purity. Glossier. I have some lip balms over here by Anu Premium. Um, I have Glossier lip balm, which is so good. I love this. I have some just regular, regular hand cream. So if like I'm about to hit the road, I could just put this in my bag. And then back here, I just have a bunch of other things. I have my mask right here. Some more moisturizers. Some more like creams, lotion. Ooh, jeez. Um. Right here, I just got this in the mail today. Yeah, I just got this in the mail today. This thing is taking forever. Okay. I got this Origins Plant Scription Anti-Aging Primer Serum. No, Power Serum. Yeah, Power Serum. So I'm, I'm excited to try this. It also came with their um, Power Anti-Aging Cream, which looks like this. So I think I'm going to use like during the day. I think that would be a really nice combo, especially because it has SPF in it. So that's perfect. And then I just have some like just random things in there like serums. I also have the Brianna Fenty. I keep forgetting what this is called. Whatever that thing is that makes you glow. I have this in there so I'm going to be bringing this on vacation with me. So yeah that is this little part right here. The first section. Down here, I have just my books. I have my two albums, which are not filled yet. So I plan to fill those up as soon as possible. I'm thinking I want to do it by, like, country. I don't know what I want to do. Like, I'm just going to do, like, two travel albums, though. So I have my Sister Soldier. I have my The Book of Negroes, Five Love Languages, Girl Boss. Um, what is this? Christopher Columbus and the African Holocaust. Maya Angelou, Thank God I'm Natural, um, My Apocrypha, um, this is Latoya's Life, her book, and then I just have my journal right here, which Munchie got for me, so I'm going to start writing, like, um, Bible study stuff in there. And then I have my lavender oil, which I use for my diffuser that I have, so this is, like, what I go to bed with because it's supposed to be very calming, it's supposed to help you sleep. And then down here is just honestly miscellaneous things. Things that I know that I'm gonna like just grab throughout, you know, the week and stuff like that. Or that I just need to see and have on deck so I don't lose them. So I have like my wallet. I have this, what do you call this? I never remember what you call this, but it's like the travel charger thing. So it's good for like all different countries. So I just need to have this on deck because last time I couldn't find mine and I ended up buying another one. So now I have two of these. My charger for my water pick. I have some batteries in there. I also have a few of my other oils for my diffuser, which I love to alternate between. I have like lemon, eucalyptus, tea tree, peppermint, and orange. So yeah, down here is just going to be random ass stuff. Oh yeah, and I'm going to put my jewelry down there as well because as you guys can see, I stack up on my gold earrings. Like I never, I always have gold earrings. It's crazy. Like all of these are gold earrings, gold necklaces, gold, 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 gold. So yeah, um, I feel like I'm almost done. It's just like all these small things that I don't know where to put. It's kind of like throwing me off, so... I'm gonna try to see what I can do about it. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna see you guys just now.